morning, good morning, good morning. Well, I'm on the move again. I am still in Florida. And I'm going to, I think, Little River. And I'm gonna go do a little bit of exploring, a little sightseeing, do a little nature walking. Go kind of hang out at the river. I did a little bit yesterday at the Ishnatukmi. I think that's called Ishnatukmi. Um, that's it. Say that three times. Come on. <laughs> but it was beautiful. It's been a while since I've uh, kind of hung out in this area. I kind of grew up in this area and used to explore this area all the time. But means that my kids are busy this weekend. I have some time on my hands. So I'm gonna do a little exploring, go get a little river life going. I know my buddy, a big wave that's from down this way that follows me is always kind of hanging out in these areas and stuff. So I wanna go check it out, just get a little bit of uh, water therapy and nature therapy and all of that stuff going. It has been an amazing, amazing, amazing trip so far. It is exactly what the doctor ordered. I needed a little bit of downtime and a little relaxation. And yesterday I actually just took like a straight relaxing day. I know, I know, it doesn't happen often. And I didn't even feel guilty about it. I think that's the first time in a long time that I have not felt guilty for just stopping and just enjoying it. So it was nice, it was a beautiful day. Did a little bit of a nature walk, went and checked out some of the springs and stuff. That's one of the main things that I miss here in Florida, of course, besides my kids and grandkids. But um, so it was nice to kind of go out and see the crystal clear water and just kind of get out in nature. I did almost break my ankle because uh, I can't walk right. Uh, it happens. I was just walking down the trail, just all nice and just walking. And next thing you know, I'm almost on the ground. I caught myself because I weevil and wobble, but I don't fall. And uh, yeah, but luckily I didn't spring it. I bounced back. Uh, could have been worse. <laughs> Definitely could have been worse. And uh, yeah, it's nice. But I'm gonna flip y'all around. I'm gonna show y'all some of the views out here because it is a gorgeous day. And then we got beautiful clouds in the sky. Some big old, I think it's called cumulus, cumulus clouds. It's been a while since I've been in school, guys. So if I'm wrong on that, don't hit me too much in the comments. Haters keep the hate now. I love you anyways. Tell me that's not sexy. That looks like it's on a some kind of magazine cover or something like that. But no rain. I was kind of hoping it would rain one of these evenings so I could just kind of relax and enjoy the rain. But I hope everybody's having a great, great weekend. I think it's Saturday. I'm kind of kind of messed up with my days right now. I don't even... Sunday. Oh, Sunday. It is Sunday. Okay, so it is not Saturday. It is Sunday. I forgot because I did not do one of these yesterday. So I hope everybody is having a great Sunday with whatever that you're doing, whether out exploring or working or getting some Jesus in you. Sometimes you need some Jesus in you. Ah, it's gorgeous though. I'm loving the little wildflowers in the ditches. Oh, i just seen a whole field of wildflowers. I think that's the first field that I've seen so far down here. Full of wildflowers. Around here you just get the ditches, guys. You just get the ditches. And whenever you see a whole field of wildflowers, hey, you just got lucky. You got lucky. I really wished I had one of those right there. The old motor e sickles. Because on a beautiful day like this, doing a little riding, like old Tim on Ridge Life. Also, uh, Tim is actually uh, out of town today right now. Uh, he is actually baptizing somebody today. I don't know if they have announced it yet on their channel about the whole baptizing thing. So I'm not going to say who it is. Um, I don't know. I don't want to spill no beans. It ain't my beans to spill. But yeah, I believe old Tim's going to be in the water. I know he's visiting his son today. And then he's going to go do a, a baptism. So I think that's pretty cool. I got baptized like a long, long time ago. Like long, long, long time ago when I was little. But I think
think it's cool because this is uh I think I was baptized in like a tub type thing you know but this is actually like at a lake or a river or something like that maybe one day I'll go get rebaptized in a lake or a river because I feel like that suits me a little bit better than like in a tub in front of the church you know I'm you know me I like that nature I'm a nature person uh, let's see here where are we coming up to I think this is the same store that y'all seen the other day when I was going to see my mama. It is. I can see the sign that says Bell and Live Oak. I've had a couple of subscribers reach out to me and say that I passed them whenever I was on this little trip right now. So if I, you were one of those, leave it in the comments and I will be here for a little while longer. I might, if my schedule works out, I might try to do a little meet and greet or something like that. Mayo. I haven't been to Mayo in forever. It's like way on down this road. We used to uh, used to be one of our rivals in football. But yeah, leave it in the comments if you are in this area right here, because I will be in the area for a few more days. And if I can work it out, I will. There are no guarantees. Don't be mad at me if I can't make it happen. But I'll see what I can do. I would like to meet a uh, big wave. He has been an OG of mine for a long time. And I, we've talked about kind of meeting up a little bit. So, Big Wave, if you were in the area and available, hit me up, uh, send me an email, and uh, let me know the details, and I'll see if I can pull that off. Um, I have not got to see my kids and grandkids yet because they are been busy, but I am seeing them tomorrow, so I am extremely, extremely excited about that. My granddaughters do not know that I am here and don't know that I am coming, so I'm sure it's going to be an epic epic little uh show up and surprise i'll try to get it on camera if i can remember because you know i'm pretty excited myself about seeing my grandbabies i'm ready to hug them and squeeze them and love them and squeeze them and hug them and love them ah, it's gonna be a good time i do not have a return date yet guys i'm just kind of winging it right now i'm just kind of hanging out and enjoying my time and loving life right now and uh I know whenever I get back to the mountain that I have a million things to do and the list is like endless and plus we got the meetup coming up so I am trying to take full advantage of this and just enjoy my time so no real plans but there is I did finalize something yesterday on the phone on the way back I will be stopping and getting something that is going to be epic for come on mountain and I do mean epic and somebody told me I need to look up the definition of epic um, I have not done that but I'm still gonna say that it's going to be epic epic <laughs> very nice oh we got another field of wildflowers see them see them see I show y'all nature all over the place all the way from central US all the way to the south we might need to go do like a, a a northwest tour here soon up uh, yep yeah, I just looked up epic <laughs> we'll do a whole video on that later but yeah having a good time I just wanted to kind of touch base with y'all and kind of let y'all know that I'm still good I'm still safe I know a lot of y'all worry about me when I go on these ventures and stuff especially if I don't post and stuff you are like uh oh what happened to the milkman you never know with me uh let's see here where are we coming up to now today i'm just letting y'all see the beauty today instead of me it kind of works out better there's a bunch of little small towns around here oh got a pop shelf i don't know what that is that's different that is a dollar general market pop shelf I don't think I've ever heard of one of those in my life. So there you go. The car wash. Car washes right now for me is a sore subject because I was just eating Subway and I uh, realized that right here on the driver's side behind my uh, door back there, I have two dents in my truck now and I have no idea where they came from. And I did go through one of those uh, spinny spinny car washes or whatever, and I think it might have dented my truck. 
that or somebody dented it and uh in a parking lot or something like that it might have happened at the river yesterday i have no idea y'all want to go stay at the steamboat inn <laughs> i love these little towns one of my favorite things to do is ride around and check out a uh, small towns that right there guys the little metal building right there is the town hall here i thought it was like a napa or something <laughs> But one thing that you do find in these little small towns is the good groceries, guys. You just hit some of these little mom and pop hole in the wall places, and that's where you find all the good groceries down south there. Oh, there's Napa. It's closed. I guess. I guess it didn't make it. Uh, uh oh. Looks like we got graffiti and chalk on the road. Capital City Bank. I used to have that bank when I lived in Florida no longer annual Swanee River catfish festival when is that second Saturday oh we done missed it we done missed it I would like to go to a catfish festival I haven't had any good catfish in a minute Ooh, I've already been talking for 11 minutes oh spin it around spin it around but I think I'm gonna get off here this was mainly just to kind of check in with y'all guys and let y'all know that I am still alive and kicking and doing well and enjoying myself and enjoying some of this r and r uh i want to send a big shout out to the drifting dreamers five for keeping the homestead alive and kicking like van damn for me while i'm on the road you guys are killing it i appreciate it i actually talk to them daily probably twice a day uh just checking on everything i'm sure Ryder's wanting to know where his daddy is right now but uh, I'll be back. I'll be back, Ryder, if you're watching. You never know with Ryder. He might be posted up watching. He might have him a little kitty cell phone or something. Who knows? You never know with that because he's different. He's different, guys. All right, guys. Love every single one of y'all. Uh, enjoy your weekend. Tomorrow is Monday. Make sure that you wake up in the morning and say, hey, today is another day closer to our goals. Let's get it. Do something nice for somebody. Reach out to somebody that you ain't talked to for a minute and tell them that you're thinking about them and that you love them and see if you can make their day, which in turn will make yours. And until we see each other again, guys, come on. Hey, keep it real.